All right, you're seeing 15W50 oil coming out of a ZL1 1LE. It's had about three to four hours of track time on the lower end. And you can notice how clean the oil is. I mean, most people will look at that oil and say, it's never been used. And yet it's had a track day at Audubon. Now, what Chevrolet wants you to do is every four hours of track time, change the oil. They want you to use a 15W50. Uh, I think it's Dexos 2. And so that's what I'm doing. Now, it's shorter than four hours. It's been less than four hours. It might be two and a half to three. But it's a whole lot easier to change it sooner rather than later. God, it's my same philosophy. Just change the oil. It's so much cheaper than a brand new LT4, which is a 6.2 liter supercharged engine. And realize this oil runs at about 280 degrees on an 85 degree day when being run hard on a track day. And there's a concept called high temperature, high shear, which is Hotel Tango, Hotel Sierra, H-T-H-S. And high temp, we all understand, uh, but high shear is a concept that all the index, viscosity index improvers in the oil are chains of chemicals. And these chemicals get sheared or broken or destroyed. And trust me, you can't look at oil and go, oh, that's had a, that's gone from 50 weight to 40 weight, which is what happens when you have a high temperature, high shear, which obviously a track day is. So it can go from a 50 weight or 50 viscosity to a 40, and you cannot look at the oil and go, oh, that's oil's fine. It's still 50 weight, because it isn't because the high shear breaks down the polymers and that reduces the viscosity from 50 to 40. And this car is not designed to run on 40 weight. And if you did run it on 40 weight, that's not what GM wants. And then if you did run 40 weight by mistake, it would be a 30 weight by the time you were done with four hours. And even though the oil looks perfectly clean, and it is, trust me, it's perfectly clean, it has been sheared the chains that cause the viscosity improvers have been destroyed by what's called HTHS. So it's always interesting. I see people at track days, they spent hundreds of dollars to get on track. They spend hundreds of dollars for fuel. They take the whole day to do it, but damn if they'll spend $50 on an oil change because they'll save money in any silly way they can. My attitude is, better to change the oil early rather than late. So that's what I'm doing because this car will be ready for its next track day with fresh 15W50. And that's the goal is to keep this engine running well. And as anybody who's tracked a car knows, you're running at five grand, six grand. That thing is working hard. It's hot, it's being revved hard, it's being driven hard. So why be so cheap as to think that saving $50, getting an extra couple of hours out of that oil is somehow gonna make a difference in your life. All it is gonna do is potentially void your warranty or even worse, ruin the engine. I'll be back. Okay, this is the oil recommended by General Motors for the ZL1 1LE for track use. It's a 15W50 and I got two of these five quart jugs for $48. So I love y'all, peace out.